20-year-old Kenyon Condre, according to his family, was a loving and caring young man who was trying to get himself together. He recently got his driver's license and was working in the warehouse of a package delivery company. Monday morning, he disappeared. His mother reported him missing. His family passed out flyers in hopes of finding him safe. His father says city police and the FBI were part of the search. We know that the FBI searched Tuesday. Uh, myself and my family, we, uh, we searched Wednesday and would, was going to continue searching Thursday. But that morning, police found a decomposing body in the 4800 block of Tamarind Road, not far from the family's home, and just a few blocks from the Baltimore Police Northern District Station. Police identified the victim as Kenyon Condre. He had been shot multiple times in the upper body. His family believes he helped guide them to where he was. As we searched for him and we yelled his name, he heard us and he knew that he was being looked for by his family and he knew that he was not alone. Kenyon's family thinks someone he trusted came to his home and got him to come outside. They say his belongings remained in the house and their front door was left wide open. They don't know if he got into someone else's car. They say they just want answers from anyone who may know anything about Kenyon's murder. Come forth, please come forth. Uh, we just ask that you come forth and reveal any information that you may have. Um, we're at peace that we have his body, that we can go forward because that was the first piece that we had, that we found his body. And the second part of this, hopefully that we can find his killers. Baltimore City Police also are asking anyone with information to contact them. Reporting live from North Baltimore, Barry Sims, WBAL-TV 11 News.